literally walking and saying, oh my gosh, this is me. She's speaking to me. And as I'm walking, my mind is literally blowing up. I'm like, hold the phone. Do I maybe have a little bit of ADHD? Hey, welcome to Motivation Moment, a weekly video series where you get to hang out with me, Katie Fortune. Lucky you. Actually, lucky me. Lucky me. Thank you for being here. All right, this week, if you watched last week, you're like, you're wearing the same outfit. Yes, yes, I am, my friend. I am batch working. What does that mean? I am doing a bunch of videos all in one day so I can get things done in time. <laughs> and so I can rest. So, by the way, if you want to talk about rest, burnout, and boundaries, check out last week's video. I'll link it here somewhere. All right, this week, I want to talk about something that actually blew my mind, and I want to hear what you guys think about this because, okay, how do I want to start this? So here's the deal. I was out for a walk because that is how I find my peace these days because of my burnout and my lack of rest. Again, watch last week's video. Uh, but I was listening to a podcast and I love this podcast. I listen to it often. And the host had a lady on talking about ADHD. And I was like, well, I don't have ADHD. This probably won't apply to me, but I'll just listen. I'm on a walk. I will listen, right? So as I'm walking and listening, listening to her story, and the host talking about it, asking her questions. I'm like literally walking and saying, oh my gosh, this is me. She's speaking to me. And as I'm walking, my mind is literally blowing up. I'm like, hold the phone. Do I maybe have a little bit of ADHD? At the very minimum, a little bit. And I'm listening and learning and my mind is blowing up everywhere. Like, that makes perfect sense for me. That's, exa like, that's exactly how I work. Oh my gosh. Like, just on and on and on. And I texted a friend of mine, and I know she told me before she has ADHD. And I said, first of all, listen to this episode. And secondly, do I have it? Because <laughs> I was like, what is happening? And I also learned that it, ADHD looks different in everyone. And that's the same for dyslexia. Like I talk about, I'm dyslexic. My dyslexia will look different than yours or your kids or whoever it is. And that's the same for ADHD. And I'm like, what? This is making so much sense. So the moral of the story here is I am self-diagnosing myself. And of course I have to take a positive out of the whole thing, right? Why not? I just do things differently. I learn differently. I think differently, like I always talk about on my Different Ability podcast. But I'm sitting here like, but maybe I am on the ADHD spectrum. Maybe I do have a little bit of ADHD. Again, very minimal, maybe. Some of the things I didn't relate to, but a lot of them I did. Especially with like the go, 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 your mind never stopping, you're doing something here and then you just never stop or starting something and trying to finish. There's a lot of things that really did resonate with me and I'm like, huh. But of course, like I said before, and I totally cut myself off and my brain didn't just do what it was supposed to. There's another sign. What I was trying to say before <laughs> is that I lost it. Crap. Okay, I remembered because I went back in the video and realized what I was actually gonna say. So, the moral of the story is, I have to take a positive out of this, right? Like, I'm self-diagnosing myself. I'm actually, I'm not diagnosed. I have no medical diagnosis here, but I'm like, yeah, I probably am on that ADHD spectrum. Now I wanna learn about it, so maybe I can do better in life and learn about myself, right? Moral of the story is, I'm a double threat. That's how I made that a positive. I'm like, okay, all right, touche. Self-diagnosing myself with ADHD over here. I am diagnosed with dyslexia. I am a double threat. I'm a double threat. Mm -hmm. Triple's coming. There's a lot of reasons I could be a triple threat, but I'll let that come out of the woodwork when it needs to. 
But how cool is that? Why not learn about ourselves? Why not get more information? It's not a bad thing. It's not scary. I came back from that walk and poor Chad was like, you guys should all give him sympathy because he has to deal with this all the time. But I came back and I'm like, oh my gosh, I figured out my life. And he's like, what? He's <laughs> just like, like, I just like, I came at him like that. I figured out my whole life. I think I'm ADHD. I'm self-diagnosing myself. And I looked at him and said, double threat right here. Watch out world, I'm coming for you. <laughs> like, I was like, I'm gonna change the world with my double threat. <laughs> so, and he's just like, okay, good for you, like a job. But my, but what I'm trying to say here is, is it's great to learn about yourself. And even if it's something that society has made it like a not great thing, I call BS on that. You can make whatever you're going through a good thing. So me going on my walk, self-diagnosing myself with at least having minimal ADHD for sure, I'm not gonna make that a bad thing. I didn't say, oh my gosh, my life is over. I said, oh my gosh, look at what I can do now. I know more, and again, self-diagnosed. I'm not, not going, I have not went to a doctor or anything like that. But I'm thinking to myself, I can learn more about this. I can do something about this because if I learn more, maybe I'll figure out different ways to make things that I'm doing easier, easier for me. So there's that for you. This video was all over the place. I don't apologize for it because that's really what my life is like. And if you can relate, comment, let me know, reach out to me and keep learning about yourself because you're worth it. You're worth knowing about who you are and how you do things, and how you think differently, do things differently. You're worth it, my friend. Have an amazing day. And as always, less hate, let's go motivate and get out there and keep learning about yourself. Because like I said, just two seconds ago, you're worth it. See you next time. This is like every day, by the way, for me. This is literally every day. Oh no, I lost it. <laughs> okay, so I don't remember what I was trying to say because I don't script any of these, by the way. And yeah, so I'll just close this up. I apologize. If I get it back, I will come back on here quick. <laughs>